It's a historic day for India's space program. The Indian Space Research Organization, or ISRO, has just reached a remarkable milestone. Its 100th mission from the Sri Harikota spaceport in Andhra Pradesh. This achievement comes as the agency continues to cement its place on the global stage. And the mission? The launch of a next-generation navigation satellite, NVS-02, into orbit. ISRO in a post said, quote-unquote, Mission success! The GSLV F-15 NVS-02 mission has been successfully accomplished. India reaches new heights in space navigation. The launch took place early on Wednesday at 6.23 am from the Sri Harikota spaceport in Andhra Pradesh. The geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle or GSLV F-15 soared into the morning sky, carrying the NVS-02 satellite, an essential part of India's growing navigation system. This wasn't just any launch, it marked ISRO's first mission of 2025. More importantly, it was the debut mission under the new leadership of ISRO's chairman, V. Narayanan, who recently took office. It's a big moment for both the agency and the country. Very good morning, India. I am extremely happy to announce from the spaceport of ISRO that the first launch of this year, 2025, has been successfully accomplished with the GSLV F-15 launch vehicle precisely injecting the navigation satellite NVS-02 in the required intended orbit. This mission is the 100th launch from our launch pads, which is very significant milestone of India. Our space program was conceived and started by visionary leader Professor Vikram Sarabhai and taken forward by generations of leaders. Couple of senior leaders are right now available in the VIP gallery. Till today, we have developed six generations of launch vehicles. The first launch vehicle was developed under the guidance of Professor Sadis Dhawan with APJ Abdul Kalam as the project director and the launch took place in the year 1979. From that till today, including today's launch, we have accomplished 100 launches from la these launch pads. Union Minister Jitendra Singh expressed his pride on social media, calling the launch a record feat. He reflected on ISRO's incredible journey, noting that it started with visionaries like Vikram Sarabhai and Satish Dhawan, and now it's a global space power. Singh celebrated the success, saying Team ISRO, once again, you have made India proud. The liftoff followed a precise 27-hour countdown. The GSLV F-15 rocket, towering at 50.9 meters, launched smoothly from the second pad at the Sri Harikota facility. This was a major step for ISRO, especially after the success of the NVS-01 mission in May 2023. The NVS-01 was the first of the second-generation satellites that are now forming part of India's own satellite navigation system known as NAV-IC. So what makes the NVS-02 satellite so important? It's a key addition to India's NAV-IC system. NAV-IC, which stands for Navigation with Indian Constellation, is India's own satellite-based navigation system. This system is designed to reduce India's dependence on foreign GPS services, like the US-run Global Positioning System. By strengthening NAV-IC, India is taking control of its navigation capabilities and advancing its technological autonomy. The NVS-02 satellite will play a major role in improving services across the country. It will help in a wide range of applications from terrestrial, aerial and maritime navigation to precision agriculture, fleet management and mobile location-based services. But that's not all. The satellite is also expected to support emerging technologies like the Internet of Things, satellite orbit determination and critical emergency response services. 
This makes NBS 02 a truly game-changing asset for India. This mission is a big deal for more than just its technological advances. It highlights how far ISRO has come in the global space race. In recent years, ISRO has made impressive strides, be it through its lunar missions, satellite launches for both domestic and international clients, or its rising influence in the commercial space sector. That's all for today. For more such news updates, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel, The Indian Express.